Hello there, boys. On today's episode of Denver, America, no oil. <laughs> We're going to correct some problems in America. Just going for a rip, are you, bud? Let's go for a rip there, bud. Oh, uh, I got a crank pulley back on this thing and a radiator that kind of fits. I don't even know what it's from. Maybe an E34? Either way, it's in there, and the hoses are connected. That one's a little kinked, but I think it should be okay. Yeah, other than that, I think it should be fine. Belt's back on, everything should be working. So now I just gotta put another $60 worth of coolant in it. And we'll be good! Uh, on the radio, when I was going to get parts for this car, they shut down I-25 at like exit 163. So if you guys are headed to Texas on I-25 South, it did say it was gonna be closed indefinitely today. Wait, that's where we're going? As you can see outside, we have the snow. Looks like jail. We are in jail. Damn it! You killed it! So we're loading the trailer, but we're also like not. Ready? Gotta swing early this time. Oh! Damn! I think I did it! <laughs> That's sexual. Update. We're in the truck. We've driven, I don't know, maybe 20-ish miles so far. And in, in the we picked up stickers and our t-shirts and stuff. We're doing a good job. Dude, the airbags, the airbags are sick. Good job on Aaron with this shit. Like it is totally different towing now with this. And it's like <laughs> the compressor shakes the whole truck when you order, and then and then when you want to air out, it lets the air into the cab. So it's like <laughs> Yeah. <laughs> In the truck, it's gonna be Hamish behind the camera, Zach right there, me right here, Will who's not there, um, <laughs> just he, he's doing seat. some stuff. And then uh, our buddy Joel, I think is gonna catch in with us. Um, our buddy Brent, angry ass guy Brent, got his M5 going today and it took a lot longer than he thought. So he's also gonna be driving down with us kind of at the same time. So we might do a little caravan action and throw some people in that M5. You guys might see some rollers. If we can throw Hamish in the M5, we can get some rollers of the, of truck. the truck and trailer cruising. So we'll see. And of the M5 rolling also. Yeah, nobody wants to see that. That's true. They just wanna see truck if and trailer. If you pay for Patreon, you can see me eat an Oreo. Do it. The Patreon link is in the bio below and also on our channel. Another thing too, if you pay for the Patreon, you can see us have a spike seltzer chugging contest. Yeah, we're gonna do a lot more drinking on Patreon. We feel like it's not so ad friendly if we're just intoxicated to the extreme all of the time. It's life friendly though. Like, so comment, do some subscribing. We need that ad revenue. No, we, I mean we don't, but please. <laughs> How about that, guys? Hi! Let's get out of here. Get Holy out of here. shit. It is so gaseous. So, huh? gaseous. It smells like gas in there. Where are we? We're in Amarillo, Texas, and it's still 33 degrees. It's cold. Did you guys come from Colorado? We sure did. did. Uh, was it, is it snowing? I caught something on it. It is. It's snowing. It's, it's not great. It's, it's not great. It's slowed down when it left. On that roof. Oh, welcome back. Hi. That's Brent from Angry Ass Solutions. Thank you. The man behind the name. That's Chris from Denver Beer and Oil, also the man from behind the name. And this is Will from Denver Beer and Oil, also the man behind the name. And this is Zach from Garage, <laughs> Your Garage LLC, also the man from behind the name. And this is Joel from the man with the company in Texas <laughs> that I forgot, also the man behind the name. Let's get after it. Let's get after it. Hell yeah, day two.
<laughs> Day two, guys. We're back at, we're still alive. We're still here at the Hilton Garden. They have a breakfast of lots of things. There's, they, you can like order eggs and they will make them for you. The sauce is questionable though. The only thing I'm concerned about is it says breakfast $9.95 over there. But none of us ate anything. I wonder I they give a fuck. I don't know if we're supposed to go. I don't know. Uh, we're in Lubbock right now, and I think we're gonna wash up before we get there, so that way all our shit looks real nice and fancy free. Gotta look fresh. It's a pretty car. I love that car. Okay, so we just got here. Literally, just got here. Uh, Will and Brent got lost along the way because technology is hard and they ran out of reception. So, anyway, we beat them slightly. I think they owe us some shots. Those sound real good. Why are those still back there? I don't think they paid attention to that. Good score. Yeah. And we're back with Chris and Will from Denver Beer and Oil. <laughs> hey guys, so just thought I'd know we're doing good out here. We made it to Texas. We got drunk, I think. And now we're drinking some coffee courtesy of the angry ass. So we're doing good. I think he does this a lot, so I'm doing that. <laughs> that is Chris. Yeah. <laughs> oh, oh, and that's Will. That's, yeah. Hi. Today, <laughs> we are going to look at the cars here at Text Fest. Oh. Yeah, okay, street, all right. Man. We are here yeah. with a bunch of delicious flavors of BMWs, Bavarian automotive engineering. And we're going to go do some driving, and I don't know what else, but we're going to do some driving. And it's going to be fun because there's a lot of really cool cars here. You want to show us uh, the one behind you that looks a lot like yeah, yours? Yeah, let's do it. Come on. This is like a cooler version of mine. Let's see if you guys can notice what looks different about this car. Dude, I don't think it's actually wide body. It absolutely is. Is Come it up, really? Yeah. Mm -hmm. Come up here. They okay. did a really good job of it. Look at the fenders. So they did oh, shit, yeah. additions under the bumper. They wide bodied it, but then they tapered it back into the factory size. And then they also wide body the rear fenders. So... This car can fit quite a bit of tire. This is a super nice car. I like this. Well, hey, let's get out of here, guys. Come on. All right. It's go time? It's go yeah, time. Let's go. We gotta go. Okay. Go. Something is, like, not happy under there. Do you think it's the exhaust? Oh, it might just be the exhaust. Yeah. I think you're right. I was thinking about that, because, like, that's the only thing that's really been fucked with. Yeah. Battery short now. Just fix that image quickly. Good. Disconnect. Okay. This was a well move. Jesus Christ. Insulated with paper? Yeah. Yeah. Fuck. No, there's fire within it. It welded the rail. Yeah. It's self clearancing. Yeah. Yeah. Like all the lights I, are going on. You the changed dash. the battery, dude. And, and I just heard arcing, and I'm like, hey, Mr. Yeah. Cameron, <laughs> he's just back there, and he's just like, it's on fire! The fucking <laughs> sound box! <laughs> like, dude, because I like, couldn't get underneath it because the fucking sound box is pinned down like, on the bench. Oh <laughs> <my God. laughs> That's awesome. I'm just like, it's on fire! This car refuses to not catch on fire. That's so hilarious. It looks really like it was just fire. perfect that you, the paper was wrapped right Well, I did that only so we could start it that one day. I thought you changed the battery back to the original one. It was sitting on the charger. <laughs> yeah, whatever. We're good. Back at it. We're driving. Well, no, these, we, the mat's got a lead, dude. No? I 
how it does that sometimes. <laughs> that, there, we're good. Okay. Definitely spat a flame out there. <laughs> yeah, she's just spinning. Yeah. She's getting it. She's fairly fast. Good. The gearing is incredible though. Like there was one time you were like ripping it and I just was like in third. And then you shifted like two times and I was just still in third. Uh, <laughs> I don't, dude, I don't know. This car is so weird. I can't figure it out. Cause it's got pretty much an M3 diff in it. It's got M3 trans, M3 everything, but it feels like it's short shifted. Mm. It feels way too short. I'm proud of this thing. No, this is cool, good. man. I'm so happy that this car is doing things. I'm just like, even though I'm not driving it, I don't care. It's like, really I just good love watching it go down the road and make boost noises. The best was that burnout after you almost caught on yeah. fire. That was a really good Dude, burnout. You were laughing so hard when you did the burnout, yeah. and then you were immediately pulled yeah. over, like fixing I things. I was like, like Jesus was Christ. Christ. So I like let off, and it was still like bouncing. <laughs> oh. <laughs> You're like, oh Jesus. <laughs> yeah, that's that's the problem with uh, uh, speed density cars too. If you get a vacuum leak, it just raises the rev. All right. So we had food, it was good. Um, I had fun, we drank beer. We found, uh, one of the dudes we're hanging out with used to own an E30 that is in our lot and it was his very first car and it's wrecked. We, we sold it to somebody, they wrecked it, we bought it back from him. Um, we're gonna like fix it for him and he's gonna get like his high school car back. Like how crazy is we're that? We're gonna build it. We're gonna build, actually we're gonna turbocharge the M20 in it too, so. Um, anyway, so pretty crazy actually, last night, he came up to me because he rec recognized me from Instagram, and then we got to talking, blah, blah, blah. Turns out we've been following each other on Instagram for a long time, and I own the car, his very first car that he bought like back in high school, and unfortunately it's wrecked now. Uh, it's maybe in some YouTube videos that we've done, I'm not sure, but long story short, we're gonna fix it, turbo it, and do some really cool shit on the channel for him. So he's getting his very first car back with way more horsepower for less than he bought it, but I, I don't know, it's gonna be badass, and we're pretty stoked about it. It's a really random chance. But uh, yeah, and as you can tell, he's got a really nice E34 540i. Six speed? Yep. Oh man. Yeah, so we're pretty stoked on it. Yeah. Do an M20 turbo build, so we can do a, some DIY stuff and if you guys wanna a, see that. You're no stranger to M20 turbo No, builds, I'm no huh? stranger to those. That's uh, kind of what got me started on the whole BMW thing, is boosting those suckers. So I'm low compression I'm boys, huh? Yeah, I'm stoked <laughs> to do another one. They're, they're almost as good as M30 turbos. Wow. The only thing that I would take over an M20 turbo would be an M30 turbo.
fuck, I just shit a brick, dude. <laughs> Why? Holy shit. What happened? Super keen on doing ignorant shit right next to the highway with Texas cops, but I'm fair go enough. There and then leave. Okay. Wait, you're doing something ignorant? Yeah. Just watching him. Yeah. <laughs> How are you people doing? I've been having a blast. It's been relaxing mainly. Meeting the meeting the good people's talking about the M cars. We sat in that one for a long time. Yeah, that was a nice car to sit in. Good morning. We're packing. We got drunk. We lost the keys to that car. We can't collapse the tent, but it's going good. It's going good. All right, so basically, <laughs> we just got back to Denver and noticed we're missing a wheel. No idea where we lost it. <laughs> Those are disposable. It's fine. Oh, oh man. That's Look at that. Yeah, so it, it looks like we were losing lugs. Yeah, like these ones are completely gone. Are the ones on the other wheels loose? Dude, you remember no. we heard some shit when we were driving? Oh, yeah, yeah, like I first it. off, I, like I when we just set off, we heard no, like there's a, no like, wheels. It was a, it was like it was no like wheels. ten hours in, but <laughs> <laughs> it was fucking hilarious. <laughs> There should have been studs, studs in here. Yeah. This has lug nuts. Well, oh shit, like yeah. I was saying it pissed. There was three One wheels. of them sheared. One of them sheared. You can see it. Okay. Yep. Or two sheared. Oh, they all sheared. All of them? Yeah. Oh, yeah, they did all shear. Yeah. That's amazing. Um, where's this place called? <laughs> Petco. Park no, no, Park Meadows. Okay, trip, so yeah, wheel. that was a fun event. Did a lot of burnouts, lost a wheel, <laughs> did some party stuff, <laughs> rode some three wheelers, crashed a bike. Uh, <laughs> we made it. Yeah, we made, we made it. That was the important thing. We made it with five out of six <laughs> wheels. <so. laughs> no, I mean, there's, there's four over there. It's less, it's less aerodynamic. But there's four now. on that, so yeah. we're good. So we have we're good. seven. <laughs> Eight, nine, nine. <laughs> that'd be that'd be nine. That'd be ten nine out of ten, out of ten wheels. <laughs> yeah. That's ninety percent. That is a, that is an A. Thank you for watching. We appreciate you. We can't do this without you guys. You're the best. Like, comment, subscribe. Please tell your friends. Please tell your mom. Please tell your dad. Tell your son. Anybody you know. Just let them know that we are nice people that do fun things with cars. Thank you.